Stephanie Scroggins. Too skinny. Julie Pate. No. April Hatton, then. I don't know. God, Alex. Don't you think any of the girls are hot? Yes, yeah, some of them. Have you seen April's gym shirt lately? If they don't give her a new one, I think it's going to explode. They're not that big. Are you kidding? Last year they were raisins. They're almost grapefruits now. By Christmas we're going to have watermelons. Now put the produce. Jude says he did it with April. No way! Way he tells it. Lots of guys have. You're kidding. I swear. I don't believe it. Whenever Jude and Johnny bring in a new guy, they take him into the woods, and they do it with April. Why? Initiation. That's awful. Why? They want to do it. You wouldn't do something like that, would you? Why not? I'll tell you why not. Because if I ever find out that either one of you are messing around with girls, especially in the woods behind the school, I'll kill both of you. You're not my brother. I'll kill you anyway. You're too young. How old were you? Older than you. End of story. Change of conversation. What do you think of Maggie? Your girlfriend? She's not my girlfriend. Whatever. You sit together, eat together, you do everything together. Everybody knows it. Just what do you think of her? She acts like a boy. None of the other girls like her, you know. They say she's a lesbian. She is not. Hey, I know she's a girlfriend, but you asked. So what if she was my girlfriend? I knew it. So? So what? That's cool. At least she's not a lesbian. That's enough. You're my friend, right? Yeah. Then don't say anything bad about her again. All right. Promise? Promise. You want to see what my dad did? Jesus, why do you do that? Seth, that's not right. You know you can tell somebody. Who? Well, we could call the police. That'd just make it worse. Well, it's not going to get any better. Did you hear me? Don't get my dad in trouble. Seth, just don't do it, okay? I think it's time you guys went to bed. Come on, I'll fix you a bed on the floor. Mr. Clark and Joey Forth wore the same pants today. Ms. Clark fell mysteriously ill after first period and went home. Coincidence? I think not. Well, this is the same girl who gets her mom to write excuse notes for her when she can't get her hair right in the morning. Stupidity is contagious. It's an epidemic. You can't tell who it's going to get next. Wow. What's Seth doing with those guys? Jude came over here and wanted to talk to him. Maybe it spreads through talking. Could be. We're going to have to check him for symptoms when he gets back. The first one for guys is they start walking like they have a huge stick up their butt. That's how Jude and Johnny walk. The girls get even phonier, especially Cassandra. I hate her so much. Yesterday, during a vocabulary test, she farted. Then she starts moving her chair around as if it was just the chair squeaking or something. Got so mad at her thinking she was above it all, so I stared at her back until she turns around and goes, What? I looked her straight in the eye and I said, You farted. <laughs> I wish I had been there. It smelled like roadkill. Hey, they're done talking. He's not coming back. Go see what they said.
What'd they want? We were just talking. About what? Stuff. Stuff? I can't hang out with you anymore. What'd they tell you? Didn't you hear me? Those guys have been picking on us for years and suddenly you're friends with them? Jude and I have always been friends. Not lately. That's because I've been hanging out with you. What's that supposed to mean? We can't be seen with you. Why not? You just don't have what it takes. What's wrong? Nothing. What happened? Nothing! Can anyone here tell me the average karyotype for the male and the female gender? David? The female gender is 46XX and the male gender is 46XY. Correct. Great. But there are variations. People with Turner syndrome have the karyotype 45XO and they are which sex? John? I don't know. This is the second time you've taken this course, John. And you still don't know the answer? Just don't remember. Maybe the third time will be a charm. Jason? Female? That is correct. And there are other variations. Persons with the karyotype 47XXY have what we call Kleinfelter syndrome. Can someone tell me the sex of such a person? Alex? Since you seem to be staring off into the far reaches of space, I guess you already know everything that needs to be known in this course. No, sir. Listen. People with the carrier type 47XXY have what we call Klein-Felter syndrome. What sex would they be? Female? No! There are numerous chromosomal variations, but the presence of the Y always makes that person what sex? Male. Now that we know and understand what scientifically classifies us as males or as females, we're going to take a look at secondary sex characteristics. That is, what effect estrogen has on the female body and what testosterone has on the male. And let's start with women. Can anyone tell us of some characteristics of the female? Breasts! Yes, I'm free. I like breast. Good. That's one. Or two, actually. Please tell me that you see more in a woman than her breast. Go to hell. What was that? Go to the office.